Your ridiculous questions are so annoying. I'm not even. I ask questions. I'm a journalist. That's what we do. What's going on, people? Literally, what's going on? Just curious. Uh, it's a TV show. A TV show? Yeah. It says end all immigration. Yeah. Oh yeah. So this is like a protest that happens in the story world. Interesting. You know, uh, I've seen online a lot of film crews, film like citizen journalists going around. Uh, it depends on the film crew, it depends on the citizen journalists. Yeah, so. yeah. That's true. I'm just wondering about the, the pylons here on public property. What's up? Mask, you like it? Yeah. Thanks. Uh, I haven't worn it yet, technically. <laughs> yeah, I'm just curious about like the process of occupying we have permits. public yeah, property. We have permits. There's an office called the Toronto Film Office. You can apply for permits to that. And that gives you permission to take, streets. take part of the street? That's correct. For a fee. It's one among many revenue streams for the city. <laughs> That's living. So you heard the pop. If you go back, you can hear a pop. He's using like a pressure trick to shoot his bottle cap off his bottle right into the park there. I think you can actually hear it bouncing up here maybe. Let's see how the, the film crews respect Toronto uh, cleanliness. Gus. Sure. You look like you're part of the film crew. No. I'd rather not the film. I think it's a little rude. Is it rude? It's fucking rude, yeah. Oh. We see how they respect the citizens, too, using profanity. <laughs> Who's doing that? Him. You reek, dude. I know. It's part of the... It's a prop. I'm sure it is. <laughs> It's for people like this to tell them, stay away from me, or you're going to regret it. At least I have respect. Sure. That's not respectful. Don't touch me. You don't fucking touch me. You touched me. I didn't touch you. You did? Yeah. It's on camera. Yeah, okay. You like that? Yeah. Here you go. See this? Yeah. <laughs> I haven't moved. He's... <laughs> Literally six inches from me. <laughs> Hit my camera. What did I do that made you so offended? It's gonna be quiet now. Yeah. Not that I caught your crimes on camera. <laughs> I suggest you keep walking. What's gonna happen if I don't? Are you his boss? No. Can I see his boss, please? I have no idea. You don't know who his boss is? Can I see your boss then? Miss, can I see your boss, please? You can keep walking. Here, I'm gonna get security. We have cops here. You gonna turn yourself in? No, I'm gonna have to cut coffee. He just said he needs to get a cop for this guy here pointed at me. Hello. Is it possible for you to get your supervisor, miss? Nope. Okay. You can see they're all like trying not to look at me, but still looking at me.
wonder if the police will inform them of charter section two. This time I'll zoom in so you can see how their their eyes are darting towards me, but they're, you know, trying to pretend like they're not looking at me. Since the film crew doesn't know about freedom of the press. I have no ill at will or ill intent. Did you hear that? No ill will, no ill intent. Just a citizen journalist. Hey man, what the hell? I complimented your mask and everything. What'd I do? I thought you, I thought you were working with them. With who? With the guys. Who's the guys? The boys you were talking with? You know, the guys. You back up a bit, you're six inches from me. Sure thing. Okay. A little more? No, this is six inches. No, like you were six inches from me, now you're about a foot and a half. Do you mind backing up a little bit more? I don't like the chemicals that you spray on yourself, but it's very offensive. I don't have any chemicals on me. Yeah, I can smell chemicals. Okay, there are a lot of people around, maybe you smell that. Yeah, it's when you got close to me, I could smell it, so. Okay, okay. Um, is there a reason you're recording? I don't do anything without a reason. Okay, so what's the reason for recording? <laughs> Have you been assigned to me? Yeah. So here I asked, have you been assigned to me just to establish that there is an intent for him to follow me around, which we'll see goes on for quite a while. So the time now is 1504. Let's see when he leaves. Yeah, no, uh, no ill will, no ill intent. I'm a citizen journalist. I have no ill intent either. Like I said, bro, I, I liked your masks even before. I'd appreciate it if your workers stopped touching me, though. Absolutely. Yeah. I didn't say, you know, this guy or anything. I just, all I had to say was I would appreciate your workers stopped touching me, and he knew who he was, so he turned around. You can't really see it on here, but this guy had, like orc looking ears his he's been wearing that mask way too long yeah you just touched me you did on my arm one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve people staring at me thirteen fourteen I can understand, like, I'm kind of a big guy, unusual looking, but most people don't carry a camera around when they commit crimes. No, no one thinks you're committing a crime. And so here again, I say, usually, usually people don't commit crimes, so that they'd say, we don't think you're committing a crime. Because now we're established that I'm lawfully there, allowed to be there, and yet I'm being followed. Persistently, maybe. Persistently followed? Maybe? Not at all. Well, what other reason for alarm would there be in such animosity towards me? Oh, it's just everyone else doesn't have a camera. You're the only one that does. So really? There's a camera right there? No, no, no. This is the movie. Us, we don't have a camera. You see what I'm saying? Like, we don't have a camera. Okay. That's why it's weird. If, if we were like oh, this... Oh, you do have a camera. No, this is a phone. Yeah, and it, it's a camera as well. But I'm illustrating I think point. most people here have camera phones. Was I holding it five seconds ago? I th no, it doesn't change the fact that your argument is invalid. I'm not sure how. I'm because every single person here 
has a, has recording. a camera, and recording. you said I don't have a camera. No, no, no. Or you said that that you don't have cameras. <laughs> Corporate Hollywood takes over your streets. They bully and intimidate you. Intimidate, intimidate. You say. Is that being intimidated? According to the Canadian Code? Intimidation. Everyone is guilty of an indictable offense and liable to imprisonment for a term of not more than five years or is guilty of an offense punishable on summary conviction. I would hope that this would just be a summary conviction. I wouldn't want to put an indictable offense on anyone's record who wrongfully and without lawful authority for the purpose of compelling another person to abstain from doing anything that he or she has a lawful right to do, or to do anything that he or she has a lawful right to abstain from doing. So clearly, the Darren was triggered, got in my face, cam-backed, all that Darren stuff, called the police on himself, everything a Darren does so beautifully illustrated here. They'd use violence or threats of violence, perhaps. Is calling the police a threat of violence? Intimidates or attempts to intimidate a person? Don't have to read all of them because you only need to be in violation of one of these things. Persistently follows that person. I'm not saying that the security guard who followed me was acting in intimidation, but someone from that organization was. I had lawful right to be there, wasn't committing any crimes, was... All I, all I did was say, don't litter in my city, please. They swear at me, get in my face, do all those things that Darren's like to do. He didn't dox himself, that's one thing I'll give him. Darren's love to dox themselves. Batter you, litter. Follow you around. If you, like, if you want to tell your, your boss, like, this guy's not a danger, he's just... So exercising his Second Amendment right, or Second Section Two right? Bro, I literally I already know you're not a policy. I walked by you. I didn't even think nothing of it. But it's my job, so I can't, you know. I but it's can't. nice to uh, have you since, like, there was everyone else is hostile. Yeah. yeah, there was like two people that have touched me, and like, you know, people give me dirty looks. I know. I, know. I mean. What's that saying? I, I, I forget the saying, but, you know, not everyone in life is a good person, but... Yeah, especially when it comes to television productions. <laughs> Weapons of mass distraction. The police officer that I complained about moved. Along with the production trucks. Looks like they're going to protect them at another location. Must be nice to be able to pay for a private army. They told me that my questions were ridiculous and drove away. Well, no, that just proves that you won the argument. <laughs> right? Am I wrong? Uh, it's online if you want to see it yourself. How? It's, uh, you got your phone out. No, it's literally dead, bro. Oh. Yeah. It's uh, the Citizens Broadcasting Cooperative. Yeah, this guy was actually pretty cool. Yeah, he didn't he didn't give me a hard time at all, and uh, seemed interested in some of the things I was saying on YouTube. Okay. Uh, so like the CBC. Citizens Broadcasting Cooperative. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, like the C the CBC, but. Okay. Uh, oh, well, CBC. That's easier to remember. Okay. But but yeah, for for citizens. Okay. Not uh, not for. Cor corporate uh, government propaganda. Yeah, I think it's really important for citizens to become the media. Nice try. This lady just walked in front of my shot. She loves section two of the charter, obviously. 
as much as she loves health. Happy, hugs, smiling, weapons of mass distraction. Back to sleep, America. Back to sleep, Canada. I will say it's cool that, you're not, that you haven't tried to get into any of my shops as well. No, no, no. That's why I'm standing at like a 45 degree angle. Yeah, and once, uh, yeah, once you got past the initial closeness, yeah. what does it say on your dog tag then? In the darkest hour when the demons come, call on me, brother, and we will fight them together. Is that, oh, nice, huh? is that nice Templar there? Oh. That was a lot of fun. Uh, I think I maybe got a new subscriber and the security guard that was following me around. Stay strong, citizens.